Hi and welcome to this tutorial on how to create and edit gradients with the Blend tool in GIMP. First of all, what is a gradient? A gradient is a smooth blending of shades from light to dark or from one color to another color. Like this gradient here from yellow to red in a gradual manner. Gradients can be used to create colorful backgrounds and special effects as well as to simulate lights and shadows. So let us start up GIMP and see how we can create gradients using GIMP. First of all, let us create a new file. And then we need to choose first of all the gradient tool or the blend tool which is this icon here. Let us now change the color of the foreground to yellow. And change the color of the background to red. As you can see in the tool options, a gradient appears which is from yellow to red. That is because the gradient that we are using right now is the foreground to background gradient. It will depend on the color that we set for foreground and background. There are many different types of gradient. The first one we are going to look at is the linear gradient meaning you will create a gradient in a linear or straight line fashion. So if I were to drag from the bottom of the page to the top, I will create a nice gradient from yellow to red from the bottom to the top. The direction of the gradient depends on how I drag. So if I were to drag from left to right, the gradient will start from left and goes to right. I can also drag diagonally from one corner to another corner. Let us look at another type of gradient. The next one is called bilinear. Bilinear means it will reflect on two sides. If I were to drag from the center to the top, it will not only create a gradient from the center to the top but also from the center to the bottom like so and if I were to drag from the center to the right it will reflect vertically let's look at the radial gradient now the radial gradient will start from the center like a circular fashion and move outwards like so. As you can see, there are a lot of different gradients. Let us try just one more, which is a spiral, which is an interesting one. If I were to drag from the center to the top of the page, I will get a very big spiral. But if I were to drag a shorter distance, I will get lots of spirals. So let us move back to the linear gradient and see how we can edit the current gradient to add another color. In order to do so, we need to open the gradients dockable dialog. So click on windows, dockable dialogs, and then select gradients. And the gradient panel will open on the right hand side here. So we are going to edit this gradient called foreground to background. So what we will do, we need to first duplicate this gradient. So right click on the gradient and choose duplicate gradient. The gradient will appear on the top right hand corner. And as you can see, there are two colors. The first thing we need to do is to right click on the gradient itself and split it into two at midpoint. Right now, there are two portions. There are three black triangles. 
one in the center and one each on the side. Double click on the portion between the first and the middle triangle. Then right click on the yellow portion and choose right endpoint color. Choose a green color. And we can see we have added a green color. Now double click on the portion between the middle black triangle and the right hand side. Right click on the red portion now and choose left endpoint color. And select the same color that we have selected just now. As you can see, we have already edited the gradient into three colors and we can adjust the varying, various proportion of the colors by moving the white and black triangles. So now you can see in the tool options, the gradient has also changed with three colors from yellow to green to red. And if I were to draw with a linear gradient right now, you will get three different colors, yellow, green, and red. And that's the way we need to edit the gradient in GIMP.